Hello. It's good to see you. Today, we are going back to Dollar General to organize the Dollar Days aisle. We haven't done that in forever, and I thought that would just be a fun thing to do today. Now it is. It's going to take a while, so sit back, relax, and enjoy some happy organizing. So here we are. We are on the Dollar Deals aisle in Dollar General. And what can we do here? Well, now you'll see that nothing has to be in a specific spot. So it's kind of like Dollar Tree. You know, you can take stuff and, and put it wherever you want to as long as it looks cool. Here we have True Living Coastal Cool Air Freshener. Do we have any other air fresheners? Uh, we do. These are Wizard up here. Home Bright. Blade. Home Bright. I'm probably looking right at this one. True Living. Huh. We have some shampoos and conditioners, carpet powder, dishwashing liquid. How did I land on a snarly product right off the bat? Oh, here it is. Okay, so let's uh, let's actually start down here now. If I do find an item that has to be moved, I'm gonna I'll take it and put it up. Like we have these little trash bags, 13, and these have a drawstring in them. They smell like Hawaii. Look at that. What does Hawaii smell like? Uh, I don't know. Well, I'll come back to that. And we have a, a partially consumed bottle of kiwi strawberry. I'll put that down here in purgatory. We won't worry about that. Somebody opened a package of generic Tylenol. Extra strength. We're going to put that down here, too. Um, okay. Trash bags. Here you can get these twist tie ones that smell like vanilla, 26 of them for a dollar. Now, unlike Dollar Tree, they have not gone to a dollar 25. They're still just a dollar, which is cool. Okay, we have Smart and Simple. These are the large bags, but these are Handy Wrap. Handy Wrap? This isn't trash bags. Well, these are trash bags. We have Glad. Here's the Handy Wrap right here. Citrus. These are the big bags. I don't know why that's there. What are you? A drink that doesn't go there. Um, here's the Hawaiian scented ones right here. Now see, these are t these are printed in such a way that you can have them like that or like that. So we're gonna put that there. I don't think this goes here. I don't think. Now you will hear the compressor on the refrigerated cases back there. They're not going to turn it off for me, so we just have to live with that. Now, up here we have a hot mess. What is all this? Sour dudes. We have sour dudes. Gold bears. Is this Haribo? Um, no, it's not. I don't think that goes here. Sour dudes. We have Lifesavers gummies. Those don't go here either. I'm going to move these for the moment. I feel like sour dudes ought to go over here somewhere. Gold bears. Right here. Right there. Sorry. Right there. Okay. Now up here, we have... All these things are great. These little felt pads. They have adhesive on the bottom. Love these things. Now... Sometimes this can be a little tricky because you have to remember I'm doing it one-handed. And this is not my dominant hand, but this is the way I just sort of seem to do it. We have heavy-duty soap pads. Look at that. Where would a soap pad go, do you think? Um, dryer sheets. Trash bags. We do have eraser sponges up here. Straws. And there we have scrubbing sponges. We have er super erasers with a scour pad. You can tell I haven't organized this aisle in a while. It's it's kind of traumatic. Um, okay, I don't see it. Sometimes you do run across an item and you don't know where it goes. Let's see. What are, like these little scrubbies, where did these go? I don't know. I'm going to put it up there for right now. 
So we were trying to make sense of this, but this doesn't go here at all. This is a this is a, a, a cheese slicer. That that doesn't go here. This we have a rechargeable light bar that doesn't go here. We have spoons, Duracell batteries. Okay, I need a, I need an admin moment. Okay, I couldn't find a shopping basket, but I found a bucket. These are not dollar items. We're going to put them in the bucket. I would have put them in a basket, but they don't have any. Okay. We have batteries and spoons. These don't go here. That doesn't go here. Those don't go here. Okay. We have more sour dudes. We have all the sour dudes in the world. Okay. These also don't go here. Is this just where people put stuff they don't want? I guess. Okay. Now we have purpose dish soap here. Let me, let me, all right. I'm like a moth. I'll lose my train of thought. More heavy duty felt pads. That's pretty great. You get 24 of them for a dollar. That's impressive. Makeup wipes. There. Okay. Now let's pull these out. What's that? Micellar cleansing water. I think we'll have room for that in a minute. Let me uh, move it for right now. So these are nail files. Diamond Cosmetics nail files. It's a fun file. It looks like fun, doesn't it? It looks like a whole lot of fun. Oh, I love all these pretty designs and colors. Get in there. Okay. Diamond. So the, you could get these two big nail files for just a dollar. Whoops. Get it right. Okay. Get that one back there. Put it in the front. Make it pretty. Okay. Next, we have Yardley. Oh, I didn't know Yardley made these. Yardley of London makes deep cleansing facial towelettes. Well, I had no idea. With hyaluronic acid essence, you get 25 of them for just a dollar. And then I can put my micellar cleansing water there. Now, there, again, there's no rhyme or reason to where any of this stuff goes. It honestly just goes wherever it fits. You don't have to put them in any certain spot, so it's okay. Oh, Yardley also has a body mist. This one is Summer Breeze. Summer Breeze Scented. And we also have uh, English Lavender. It's kind of dented. Diapers. Look at this. You could get a little packet of diapers. Now, these are size 3. These are from Fisher Price. You get four diapers in there. These are size, oh, these are all size three. Let's see. Some of them are turned sideways. I'm going to leave those in the back turned sideways, just like they are. Okay. Let's see. Now, I still have my felt pads, but they, they won't fit. Let's see. We have stuff up here, too. We have these boxes of stuff. You could get a no scratch, a hand saver scour thingy, a washcloth. You get two waffle weave washcloths for a dollar, and reusable ice cubes. There. Washcloths. We have herbal charcoal toothpaste from Brush Buddies. And we have some over-the-counter medications. What's this one? This is like generic Dayquil. I, no, it's not. Yes, it is. Dayquil, severe cold and flu. This has acetaminophen in it, which is your pain reliever and fever reducer. That's your generic Tylenol. Dextromethorphan, 10 milligrams, which is a cough suppressant. That's like generic Delsa. Guaifenesin, 200 milligrams, which is like half the regular dose, I think. An expectorant to loosen chest congestion. It's like generic um, Mucinex, I believe. Phenylephrine is horrible. It's a nasal decongestant that doesn't work. 
gets pseudoephedrine, it works better. Not medical advice. I'm a goober on the internet. Don't listen to me. Oh, Lord, there's a mess back yonder. I need my go-go gadget arms. I can't... I'm going to... I'm going to reach what I can. Oh, help us. Help me. Help me, Lord. We have pre... Pre-poo toilet spray. <laughs> oh, damn it. Hold on. Pardon my potty mouth. I, I get a little foul-mouthed from time to time. You can see more than I can reach, more than likely. Okay. Oh, here's another one. We have generic uh, Allegra, no, Zyrtec. Cetirazine, this is 10 milligrams. It's an antihistamine, uh, brand name of that is Zyrtec. Allegra would be Fexofenadine, this is Cetirazine. I worked in hospital pharmacy for a number of years and had to memorize lots of um, generic drug names. That's why I know those. I also worked in retail pharmacy, but I had to learn all the generic drug names working in hospital pharmacy because everything was alphabetized by the generic name. These boxes are about as stable as my ex-husband. Come on, baby. There you go. You need somebody to support you, don't you? You can't make it on your own. You're so pitiful. Oh, yes. Just like my ex-husband. Okay. Oh, there's another one back there. Please don't fall. There we go. Oh, crap. There's more. We've got cotton balls hiding back there. Satyrazine, why do I only have one of you? Cotton balls. We're putting cotton balls here. Advil PM, we have two of those. Oops. I can't reach the cotton balls. There. This is hard on me, I'm telling you what. Stand up. Be happy. Here are some more soap. Uh, what did I do with the other soap pads? I set them down, didn't I? They're slow cooker liners and cups, but they're on their own because I don't have room for them. We have fabric softener. I believe I saw this. Didn't I see this somewhere? I thought I did. Got cleaners up there. Dryer sheets. Where did I see this? I could have sworn I saw it somewhere. They look down here. Plus, we have boxes in the way. Somebody took out a root beer. I saw it. I know where it is. I don't know. I'm going to put it right there for now. Yeah, here's the root beer. They pulled it out of the six-pack. I'm going to leave it in that box. I don't, I don't know. This aisle is a mess. It's a mess. Oh, here are the soap pads. I found them. This aisle is as random as a bad dream, isn't it? Okay, felt pads. I got bad news for you felt pads. Right now, I don't know where you're going. I don't think there's a home for you, sweetheart. I'm going to defer that decision for the moment. I'm putting them there. Okay, hand sanit. Oh, where'd you come from, hand sanitizer? Well, here's some sunbur sunburn relief gel might be able to fit it here like that here we oh look Yardley even makes deodorant I had no idea they made all these products yeah I didn't know that that's interesting now let me get back to where I was we were looking here going on to this this bottle is pretty it looks like something from the 70s or something it has a cool design to it purpose dish soap Ocean mineral flavor. Okay. Getting them all. Now we have Power Stick. This is a moisturizing body wash. Relaxing. Lavender and shea butter. I have bought some wonderful body washes here. I have. They used to have this Himalayan salt body wash. And it was only a dollar, and it was a little bit bigger than that. But they don't, I don't think they have it anymore. Let's see. Tr 
trying to see if I can bring a little, ooh, see, no, that's not going to work. We won't do that. We have Victory Flavored Avocado Oil Conditioner from LA Lux and 3 Peat 3 in 1 Hand Body Wash Shampoo and Conditioner here. Sandalwood and Amber. We have VO5, the Passion Fruit Smoothie Shampoo. I wonder if Suave still makes that strawberry shampoo. I bet they do. And we have this uh, moisturizing conditioner, passion fruit smoothie. And we have just, this is what my mom used to buy. She would buy the, the VO5, just the plain VO5 shampoo and conditioner. It used to come in this teardrop shaped bottle back in the late 70s, early 80s. And there was a Clairol shampoo and conditioner she would buy. Yeah. We have Unisom, it's brand name. It's just diphenhydramine, which is, that's the generic name of Benadryl. That's all it is. Non-habit forming. Oh, here we have some micellar cleansing water. Now, let me see. I might be able to reposition those bottles I had a minute ago. Oh, they're all in there wonky. Yeah, here's, no, that's hand sanitizer. Dang it. Yeah, um, trying to get them all kind of turned the same way. I see some zipper bags back there, gallon side. God, these are long. I mean, they don't go back there, but Lord God, where am I going to put something that long? We don't have that much real estate available. Look. I was looking to see if I could see any, you know, there may be already some out. Oh, we have some up here. They're standing them up like, oh, there's that. There's that swat swabatel stuff. We have a little space here. Here. Shoot. Electronic. Oh, Mary, no, no, no. You've messed up. You shouldn't have angered the beast. Oh, God. Why would, you can't stack them like that. You can't. They're going to fall and smack somebody in the head. Well, shoot. Hang on a minute. I dropped that and I shook it up. Now it's all upset with me. Well, I didn't drop it. It just got knocked off. So did that. Because I was trying to get this. And somehow I, ch I caused a chain reaction. Okay. Sticking them up there. It's not ideal, but whatever. I don't know where the hell this goes. Okay. Sorry about that. It'll calm back down. The, bu the bubbles and the fizziness will calm down. It won't stay like that. Okay. Let's see if I have enough room to turn them this way. Oh, I have too many. I wanted to leave room for the hand sanitizer to kind of work its way up here. Where's the other hand sanitizer? Yeah, right here. So we could put these in here. Okay. Okay, we need to come back here. Now we have some body washes. Look at this. White Rain Purely Coconut Oil Body Wash. Now that is 12 ounces for a dollar. These used to be larger. We have Power Stick Energizing Pomegranate and White Tea Body Wash. Here we have Refreshing Cucumber and Green Tea. From Personal Care Shea Solutions, we have a Coconut Oil Body Wash made with organic coconut oil. Those are also 12 ounces. I think they used to be 16 ounces, so they have got a little smaller. From Spa Soap, we have this Invigorating Vanilla and Honey Body Wash. Now that is 20 ounces. Extra Moisturizing and Deep Cleansing. And we have a White Rain Men's 3-in-1. That's a 3-in-1 from LA Looks. I'm just going to leave them down here. There's another refreshing right there. We'll put that with this one. 
there. We have Ladies Choice Feminine Wash. Spa Soap Cocoa Butter. Here's another one of these. Scoot that in there. Cocoa Butter Body Wash. Okay. Next we have Lavoris Fresh Breath Mouth Wash. That is 16.9 ounces. 500 milliliters. I'm going to make two little sections of that. I always have to mention when we see the Lavoris that my mother was a social worker back in the 80s and 90s and um, one of her clients wanted to name her daughter Lavoris because she said it sounded pretty and uh, I think the nurse ended up talking her out of it and said you can't name your kid after a mouthwash because the other kids will pick on her so I think she ended up naming her something else but I don't I don't know what we have sunburn relief gel that's pretty great from Lucky. I think we've seen this at Dollar Tree. And that leaves us room for our Yardley English Lavender Roll-On Deodorant. We, we don't have it all crammed in there now. I don't like these because they don't they don't organize as well. They fall over and stuff. Okay. Oh, that looks better already. Don't, don't, don't look at that. Don't look at that. No, no. Focus on the positive. We got our fake poopery up here. It's lavender scented. It's for the toilet. I'm not going to say it's flavored. I can't even do that. Okay. Prado Baby. These are baby wipes. Okay. All of these, all of these diapers are a size three. I was going to see if I could put the sensitive ones separately, even though I'm having to turn them that way. Oh shoot, there's a third one. We have sensitive and regular. Well, I'm just going to, I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm just going to do the sensitive ones here. Like turn these all the same way. That. Did I? I, they are turned the same way. Okay. Got that. We have more than one kind of toothpaste here. We have some Colgate cavity protection back there. Crest with scope. Okay. Man, I thought I had really done something here. Now look down here. Do you believe this? I, I mean, they're all mixed. I, okay. Yeah, that is terrible. We have three different kinds and they're all mixed up and it looks like a hot mess. Okay, here's one over here. I can't, they go all the way back. I was going to pull them out and redo them, but I, I can't. I have nowhere to put them. I'm sorry. Don't look at that. I, there's literally nothing I can do about it. Well, there, there, I mean, I could pull all of those out. I'm not going to. I have, I have nowhere to put them, and it's a Saturday, and this store is busy, and I, I, I have a skinny aisle as it is. What is this? In Sueno, in Sueno, original fabric softener. Never heard of that one. The bottle looks like it has botulism. Is it supposed to be puffy? Fabric softener can't have botulism. Let's see. Well, I don't think it can. Now we have another product stuck in here. We have two of them. Fabuloso Antibacterial. There's more of it down here. Antibacterial Fabuloso. I've never heard of that. Huh, it's a multi-purpose cleaner. Interesting. I'm just, there's another one back there. I'll put it down here. Okay. Now, we can kind of move these back a little. Put that there. And that gives us room for this Ajax dishwashing liquid. This is vinegar and lime flavored Ajax hand sanitizer that fell down behind the shelf back there. Okay. I have to occasionally stop 
because customers come through and I, I try to get out of the way. So sometimes I forget where I was because you wouldn't believe the amount of conversation that can go on over here between two people. People love to talk about this stuff. I've even helped people pick stuff out. They couldn't decide on a fabric softener, so we had a discussion about fabric softener. <laughs> it's fine. I'm fine. I don't care. I'm having fun. All right. I, I don't mind talking to people. I don't know what it is. Everywhere I go, people will just come up and start talking to me. <laughs> I've been that way forever. I'd say since my 20s. Every time I go out, somebody will just come strike up a conversation. It's, it's very interesting. Um, this is different. Uh, I know it doesn't really go here, but I'm going to stick it here because I have space. It's right there. I'd like to have all the same products together, but the, well, I mean, what would I do? I would have to pull everything off the shelf and redo it, and that's not going to happen. Now, this rest complete also has scope mouthwash stuff in it okay over two times more free very nice this is the three pack of palm olive classic scent that we have organized many times at Dollar Tree here you can still get it for a dollar instead of a dollar twenty-five just a handy tip if you have a dollar general in your area, definitely check out the dollar section. All this stuff is just a dollar. That and you know, that's great. We have some large trash bags back here. Let's see. Smart and simple. Now we did see these. I hear some more right here. Okay. Large trash bags. 30 gallons. Seven bags. The box is different though. That is, is it completely full? What is going on back there? It's full. Yeah, and here's another one. Ugh, we're going to have to work on that. Somebody decided to sample these freezer bags. I'm sticking it in the bucket. I, I'm, I don't know why I'm going that way. I need to come back down. We have lavender bouquet antibacterial hand soap from Lucky super soft and we have these little finger paints they have these at Dollar Tree as well you have screaming green firefly red royal purple oh look at that blue to full blue that's pretty here's another one of these juicy green apples where did I see that where did we have green apple stuff? Oh, it's over here. We haven't gotten there yet. I just saw it earlier. Okay. Royal purple. There. Look at that. Blue to full blue. Purple. Here's one of those little scrubbies. Those go up here. Okay. We have some soap. Classic gold from White Rain. You can get two bars for a dollar. And we have Coast as well. You can get two bars of Coast for a dollar. I thought they would raise their price on this stuff, but so far they have not. This stuff down here looks pretty good. What is that? That is some of that Victory Avocado Oil Conditioner. Oh, that was up here. They don't have the shampoo, they just have the conditioner. That's fine. I saw a soap, a finger paint, yeah, right there. It's a pink one. From Tame. Oh, do you remember Tame shampoo and conditioner? Look, oh, isn't that beautiful? Exotic Argan Shine Repairing Shampoo with Aloe Vera. And they have Tropical Coconut Breeze with Shea Butter. Oh, isn't that pretty? This is all tropical coconut. They only have one of these. Those are all coconut. And then we have Daily Defense Hydrating Coconut. LA Colors Champion. Hmm. 
They only have the shampoo. They don't have the conditioner. Pretty sure this is all shampoo. The conditioner has a white lid on it. This is three peat right here. That had fallen down back there. We're going to save it. I have not thought of tame shampoo or conditioner in probably 30 years. I had no idea they still made it. This is squeezed in here very tightly. I'm not a fan. Let's see. That is more of the tropical coconut. I need to see if I can slide these over just a bit to give that stuff a little bit more of a little bit more wiggle room. Yeah, every bit of that is coconut. Okay. So then we do the daily defense. You know, we've been here for over a half hour and we haven't made it past the first section yet. We may not get to the end of this aisle. Because <laughs> I I don't know if I'm going to do it. Okay, Salon Selectives, Volume Body Conditioner. Okay, and then the Green Apple. Down here, I remember love my carpet. My mom used to love that stuff back in the 80s. This is a classic scent, Coast. Honey, I got no room for you. You have to live right there. LA looks. There's another one of those that fell down behind. And a green apple that fell down behind. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. Oh, oh it's nice. I'm very happy. Don't look at that. I, I can't do a dang thing about it. Now down here we have rust, lime, and calcium cleaner. Gain dishwashing liquid. Ajax again. LA's totally awesome window cleaner. Vinegar formula. These are only a buck for these bottles. It's fantastic. I like that, um, that general purpose cleaner from LA's Totally Awesome, that yellow bottle. That stuff will clean anything. It is wonderful. We have premium white assorted cutlery sets. Oh, I see. Let's pull this up here. And then we have these three here. So we're going to just do it like that. This is a good deal right here. Mucus Relief. From Right Remedies, four tablets, and it has 400 milligrams of glyphenicin, which is generic uh, mucinex, 20 milligrams of dextromethorphan, which is generic delsum. Okay, I'm just gonna grab these lightly. Crystal Light, honey, this does not go here. This is not a dollar. It's not. That's the gallon size. Okay. Fabric softeners. We have Gain and Fresh Honeysuckle. I tried these once. They're awful. They don't really seem to do anything at all. and They, they have no smell to them at all. And they don't seem to work. So I, I do not recommend these. They're terrible. Um, I don't see them. They're going right here for the moment. Insect repellent wipes, dishwasher detergent powder, and we have like knockoff magic erasers. You get two of them and they stick to each other for some reason. These boxes are not cooperating at all. So it's two, and they're from Home. We have vitamin C, a bunch of vitamin C, plus wild rose hips. That was the name of my best friend in middle school, wild rose hips. I'm kidding. Fragonzia with Clorox, it's lemon flavor, and there's no room for it. Where am I supposed to put these if it's full? It is full, slam full. I'm gonna put it right on the edge. I don't like doing that, but I'm doing it. This, okay. storage bags and look they got to do the limbo to get out of there 
they're too tall for this shelf. They are. They're too tall for this shelf. Got them stuck under my arm. This way. I crushed that one between my thighs. That's been working out too hard. I crushed it a little bit without meaning to. <laughs> I don't know my own strength. Okay. Dang it. These things are ornery. They don't want to go at all. Well, the problem is we have too many rows of stuff and I can't really do anything about it because we have so much of it. So it's, it's a problem. I like this poor scrub free. I mean, where is it supposed to go? I might turn it sideways. I don't like it, but shoot. That gives these a little bit more room. Okay. Yeah, it's not ideal, but oh well. Insect wipes. We have this disinfectant spray. This one is lavender. This is Glade. We have Wizard. This is Glade. Where did we see the Glade? I saw some Glade. Where was it? Look at all these things. I'll just leave it there. Okay, we have orange flavor, citrus scent. Lavender, what am I going to do with you? Dang it. I don't know. These are the citrus. They're a little bit tall for the shelf. Oh, crap. Let's see. Let's stick that lavender right there. This is linen scent. I'm going to do the best I can with these. I can't really reach back there to get any more. Country scent. Ugh. Okay, now here we run into the problematic trash bags. Don't look at what I'm doing right now. This is wrong. I'm just gonna have to leave them like they are. I don't. I don't know. I can at least kind of turn them a certain way. Here. That's all I know to do. Oh, here's the spa soap. We see this at Dollar Tree. These big things like this. 32 ounces for a dollar. That's a good deal. I remember one time they had just the clear soap. I bought two or three of these. It was big. It was like this and it was only a dollar. And we use a lot of liquid soap at my house. and we're, We go through it. So I bought two, like two or three of them. I'm still using them. That was over a year ago. Okay. We have some little plastic cups. We have some LA's totally awesome window cleaner down here. Where did this come from? I see Clorox. Oh, here it is. I'm leaving it on top of that box. Well, I mean, if you look at what we've done, it looks good. Just ignore the rest. <laughs> okay. These are plastic cups right here. Then we have these Ripple Hot Cups. Who aren't they cool? 16 ounce Ripple Hot Cups. Little Ripple Coffee Cups. Here. And little snack bowls. Look at those. That dang blade keeps coming back like a bad penny. I'm sticking you up there. I don't know. Odor Eliminator, Smoke Out. I'm putting it next to the Lavender Toilet Cleaner because that's where the rest of it is. We even have Dr. Flush, Automatic Toilet Bowl Cleaner. Fresh Blue Water, well yeah, Blue Water, just as nature intended. Smells like a gas station. Okay, Wizard. You don't 
go there, you little... Why is there a whole bunch of it right there? Oh, because that's full. Well, it's going to have to stay there. Freshly picked lavender, morning mist, Hawaiian retreat. And you have two of these little doodahs. Oh, they go over here. Look at these fun little things. Oh, this one's pretty. Cinnamon churros. Oh, I love churros. They're so good. Oh, you can get really good ones here. So good. Okay. Apple cider. Pumpkin spice. You're going to just be where you are. Gingerbread joy. Apple spice bliss. Yummy. These are all mixed up. Some of these are just in here like an assortment. You know? Just, I can't do anything about it. I'm just going to put them down. They're all mixed up. Here's a random candle with the lid off of it. I got that lid back on there one-handed. I'm impressed. Let's see. Let's see what I can do here. We have great scents. Oh, these are candy corn scented. Look, highly fragranced candle. There's a whole bunch of these little bitches. Let's see. Summer solstice, blackberries and sage. I don't know how I ended up way down here. I didn't mean to. Let's do that one. I do have some fabric softener here. It's not the ones I was looking for. Oh dear God, what is this? Hot, fresh hell. Super eraser, bam. Extra strength, kaboom. Snack bowls, you don't go there. It's a Mr. Clean. You can get one of these. Here's a Colgate for kids. Colgate Ultra White with Charcoal. I don't have anywhere to put these. I literally don't. Let's see. Kids Colgate. Ugh. I saw some toothpaste down here. What was it? Oh, there's AIM. Oh, God, there's more. Look, there's more. We have, ugh. We have all this toothpaste here. Flash. Flash. Okay, I'm getting a little punchy now. Here we go. Sorry. We have some baby ones, some big ones. That definitely is not a dollar. Off to the bucket you go with your friends. Ooh. This makes me happy. Look at, wow. Look at that. Extra, nice and fluffy. Nice and fluffy. We have our Ajax Ultra. Oh, that is so. It's full. Okay, this Ajax is very, very full. I have two bottles that won't fit. Aim. It's awesome, Aim, but it was a different kind. I'm not worried about it right now. I'm just putting it down there. This definitely does not go here. It's a flawless ice roller. That is not a dollar. It's not a basket, but it was the best thing I could find. Okay. Here's another extra fluffy. I'm losing my place on this aisle. No, this one's purple. This one's green. That's going up there anyway. There's this. Itch stopping. This is stock, but has not been put out yet. Somebody's going to come along and see this and think it's a dollar. <laughs> it isn't. That is stock that hasn't been put out. We have all-purpose clips. That goes up there. 
That's not a dollar. I know that's, I feel like I'm on the prices right. That is not a dollar. Bob's looking at me like, are you sure? <laughs> yes, Bob. And now that's something else. Let's see. We have these handy wraps. Let's turn them this way. Maybe I can make some more room. We have some free range sponges down. Oh God, we have a bunch of sponges trying to escape. They were going to make a run for it. Shawshank Redemption style and I grabbed them out of the sewer. The very anticlimactic end to the movie. Back up there you go. Okay. Well, we are going to do this because I said so. Okay, and that gives me actually little bit of room and we're probably gonna have to put some stuff there now this Ajax for one thing has nowhere to go and then we have this Kleenex here you can get a little box of Kleenex for a dollar okay we have this LA's totally awesome fabric softener which could go literally anywhere um, we have a lot of big bottles of stuff Somebody stole a Lego set. Look at that. Somebody stole a daggum Lego set. Stuffed it in there. Oh my goodness. Okay. Green. Orange. Purple. Ooh, I can't. I'm going to have to turn that one sideways. fit in there sideways. That sucks. Hey, look, I didn't know Extra made a scent booster. It's an in-wash scent booster. Okay. We have all these products. Um, bang, bathroom and shower cleaner. And then I have a multi-surface cleaner from LA's Totally Awesome. Oh, that's why it's back there. It's full. I'm going to have to leave it back there. It's full. We have Coraline. Do we have this anywhere? That's not it. Oh, there's some down here. Let's stick that right there. Okay. Okay, I'm going to have to just give the rest of this a once a once over. We have LA's Totally Awesome All-Purpose Cleaner, Cherry Blossom Flavor. This one is a Daily Shower Cleaner. We have a spa soap here that's Lavender Flavor. Love my carpet. Foaming Bathroom Cleaner. Oven cleaner, cleaning vinegar. That's cool. There's another bathroom cleaner. It's very full. We have mothballs. Are these a dollar? I guess they are. Heck, <laughs> crazy straws. Oh, I used to love these. We have a lot of just random stuff right here. Um, and none of it really goes anywhere. <laughs> like there's not a whole bunch of it. I'm going to just leave it where it is. Forks and spoons. These are clear. Yeah, it's like these, but that's full. Crazy straws. I haven't seen any crazy straws, have I? Looking up there. A 
we are going to lovingly place a lot of this stuff here. More smoke out, odor eliminator. We are going to lovingly place this stuff here because I don't know where else to put it. Fresh. I don't know where you go. Mega dryer sheets. Here. Twelve of them. I'm stacking all of these dryer sheets up. I know they don't go together, but they don't have a home anywhere, so we'll put these right here. Blue Gain Ultra Clean. There's a green. Of course, is there a blue one? Um, there's some more green. I'll just put it right there. If I, maybe if I find it, I'll move it. Okay, actually, I just saw the Mega Dryer Sheets right here. That's an empty spray bottle. So these actually go here. So we did find where those go. I'm just gonna scoot this around. We have fabric refresher. I feel like that would be something that I could find. Or not. I'm gonna put it there. Okay, that. We have this uh, fabuloso stuff. Here's some right here antibacterial. Some kind of purple flavor. I don't know what that is. Penelman Fresh Pine. Okay. I'm just gonna leave it like that. I'm just gently tidying up a, a little, a little bitty bit. Here. Foaming bathroom cleaners. Toilet bowl cleaners with bleach. Ah, oh, these candles are glass. I don't want to mess with them too much one-handed. I don't want to risk dropping one or pulling one off the shelf. Household ant solution. Insect repellent. Little spray bottles. For a dollar. Okay. Brillo Basics. Bathroom wipe. More premium forks. Going to put them here. I'll just put them there with the others. Okay. This has been opened. I don't know if they want that up there. This is the regular ones. Where were they? Oh. Ultra Clean. This is dishwashing liquid. Oh, here's that stuff I was telling you about. The LA's Totally Awesome All Purpose Concentrated Cleaner. This one has a little thing like this. That's cool. LA's Totally Awesome with Bleach. Daily Shower again. Pine Glow Lavender. Where did this come from? No. Cleaner with bleach. There. Lime away. We have some gain fabric softener shoved in here. Like so. Um, yeah. Okay. I had some kids crest over there. I'm gonna put it with the other one. Look how pretty it is. Oh my gosh, y'all. Where'd I put that kid's crest? I don't know. 
That's regular Colgate scope. I don't know. Yay! Look! Oh! This makes me very happy. True Living Hawaiian Escape. Look, those little cool air fresheners. Crestwood scope. Radiant Mint. Then we have this. Oh, these are all different. These are all. These are all different. Look at this. This is stain eraser with fresh mint. Icy clean. These are little. These are all mixed up, and I have nowhere to put them. Um. Ooh, this does not sit right with me, but. I have so many different types. Oh, I can't do it. I can't. I can't stand it. I agree with that crying baby over there. This makes me want to cry. I don't like this. They're all freaking different. There's nowhere to put them. So, oh, we have a random Sensodyne. Oh, this is awful. Let's see. We have two different types of AIM. Sensodyne, I guess, is just going to have to live there. Okay. Is this game with Febreze? That does not want to come out. There. Just doing a little bit of general tidying here. Okay. Now that is not perfect. It isn't perfect, but look at that. Oh, wow. We have to admire our handiwork. Look, look at what we've look what we've done. Oh the dollar section is beautiful again. I am in love with it. I am totally in love with this dollar section. Look at that. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed getting to see the Dollar Days Isle at Dollar General. It has been quite a while. We have to do it a little bit more often. I really enjoyed that. Um, it's, it's always fun to make order out of chaos. I don't know. I find that so satisfying. <laughs> Thank you so much for being here. I really hope that you have a wonderful day and I'll see you again really soon.